The Accra Academy School today took its turn at the Cowbell Hot Balloon Session, Hot Air Balloon Session. Now, today's Cowbell in the Sky flight recorded the highest uh, flight above the ground today with about 780 meters. Now, unlike other trips which ended up around Adan, today they took a different turn towards Dodua. Nancy Emefra Jadusi, as usual, was stuck on the ground but she got all the information for us in this report. Hi, how was the flight for you? Marvelous, marvelous one, because we were at the highest uh, level here. We never reached in Ghana, so we are 750 meters. And the, 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 the view was beautiful, beautiful, with the weather, it's marvelous. The Ghana country is really, really nice. Were you guys scared because you didn't know where exactly you were going to land? Oh no, we are not scared, because seeing the view up there, it was very nice. So we, we are just relaxing up there. Yeah. You wanted to go to Dubai, unfortunately, you are, you are landed here. Oh, in Ghana. oh, but I'll take it like that. <laughs> All right, so let me try and also engage um, Pilot Kuhn to tell us exactly how he will describe today's flight. Hi, Hi. was the journey for you today? It was fantastic. Um, it was the first time that we had this direction, so completely different direction than all the flights before. And uh, way up high, we went very, very high, and we had a speed of 30 kilometers an hour, and, and that way we could steer the balloon to this place to land, so really great. Right, so um, this is all the second time in a row uh, we have managed to get the landing um, of the hot air balloon here. So I don't know where we are right now. Where is this? Here's where is it? Can we come closer? Okay, so Dodo, this is Dodo. This is Dodo Dumas. This is the Metro Mars site. It's a new area that we are just I think we saw you on the way. Whether you were so excited, you had to drive and, and chase yeah, the balloon. When I saw that thing on the hair, I know it's a uh, uh, land around. And my kids, they are always happy when they see it on TV. So I decided to move the car so that I would change you people where it will land so that they can have a feeling of the. That's why I was chasing you. What's your name? Stephanie. Stephanie, are you happy seeing the hotel balloon today? Yes. How you excited? When you saw it, what did you tell mommy? I told mommy I want to even sit in. Oh, so you want to you want to sit inside right now? Yes. And So yes, I have actually been in a hotel ballet. I don't think any present boy has been in a hotel ballet. But we have been two Akraka boys from my year group that has been in a hotel balloon and the experience is amazing. It is beautiful, it is fantastic. And how did I get there? I took that chance. Most of the time is classroom learning. Um, the science students go to the lab and so on. However, this is uh, a real experience of what Archimedes principle is all about. And I think that when you have um, lessons illustrated this way, uh, it gives them a lifetime experience. It is interesting and exciting. And that alone, the interest and the excitement makes children uh, learn so much. Uh, because it sticks better, you know, and I think that uh, the various companies we have in our country, some of them are supplies to our schools and so on and so forth, they should give back to the schools, uh, go into educational programs just like this and get our children who would pass out in any way to come back and work with them. In the